This is the Soy Boys podcast. What? Finally, yeah. after years of saying it'll happen, huh? I made it happen. What? I did you didn't really this. make it happen. You you literally just like begged at us, like, please, please record the podcast with me, please. Today, for the first <laughs> episode, we're going to talk about the nominees for the Game Awards 2023. And uh, yeah, we're just going to talk about it. I don't know. No one's going to watch this. No one's going to listen to it. But that's fine. Because this is fun. Hey, I'm Morgan. So we have we have five resident uh, video game experts here on the panel to, to discuss uh, to discuss the game awards. Uh, you, you if you're an avid watcher of Soy Boys, you will know who they all are. Um. So. Uh, uh, yeah, this goes out to you, Jason. <laughs> do we want to like do do we want to do like 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 name like like roll call or is that or is that cringe? I mean, we might as no, we well. Don't. Uh... What was it? I... There's gonna be five different voices talking. There'll be like which annoying person is talking right now. They know y'all. You just guys. You guys had to introduce me because I'm the mythical True. creature. Yeah, we have mythical creature Marcello in the yeah, building, it's known for world. the bio, known for the Bioshock Let's Play in the I fucking pipe, lads. <laughs> <laughs> he was in the Twilight Princess playlist that never got uploaded. In the pipe part two, in right. the pipe. It's just gonna be. Yeah. Uh, he's also also in the pipeline. The the 80, 80, 100 part Fallout New Vegas. Let's play. Yeah, yeah, yes, yeah. with no commentary. <laughs> That, and, uh, we also... It's just like every part of the Let's Play, I just play until it crashes. <laughs> and then you <laughs> start okay, so it's like 30 second, second video. Okay, Sometimes cool. I get some good stretches in there. Like, so it's, gonna, it's gonna be like a 30 <laughs> second video. It can, no, that's a that's a banger idea because it can be like a 30 second video, or it can be like. I'm, I'm just hours. saying, game of the year <laughs> is gonna be Marcello's um, sixth uh, modded New Vegas playthrough until it crashes. Dude. Because he spawned <laughs> too many pregnant sunny small babies onto the street. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, Marcello won content creator of the year with that series. Yeah. Uh, we also got Steven over here. Right, I hate doing the introductions. It's just a cordy. Just introduce the categories. You're cordy! Shut up! This guy's okay. pro Splatoon player. Steven's an OG. He's a pro Splatoon player. He was, he was, in, the in, he was in the first one. He was literally in the first Splatoon. video. You imagine he's in the first Let's Play where he fell yeah. asleep. Yes, <laughs> don't look up any other play. No, he didn't fall asleep. He didn't the fall asleep till the second episode. He did no. He, that's, he did the first episode, uh, the first playthrough live in my basement. Anyways, let, we're, let's we're stop gonna have to cut so much of this shit. What are we dilly dallying? No, we're just so white on here, right? I know. Um. Yeah, we're just let's just let's let's just talk about the the game. How about we don't? So How I, about I have, how about oh, we well. look at your beatbox uh, window and your favorites? Ever? Shut up. No, I think we should really discuss how bad company two is. <laughs> Why don't we look at uh, po- uh, Pokey hey. main community up there beside Lost Ark? Yep. What? Holy what? Shit. Does that Pokey, even Pokey mean? Community. Pokey not community. Not oh yeah, that's that's a that's a uh, yeah, that's that's. that's oh that's, my that's god! No, nope, they're how, not how gonna about we see any of this. On, this uh, podcast. Sorry, Steven's calling me out of my bookmark. Group masturbation. Uh, so let's spin. Yeah, both you porn and porn. Yeah, Patreon subscribers get a group masturbation. No, no, that, that's that's like in between each category. We goon. <laughs> okay. And we got and Should like take the, an intermission mid. To goon? Yeah, <laughs> we take you take an intermission to get get hard again. Yeah, and oh, then yeah. while we talk about the okay, category, okay, uh, that's when like, we rehard in your cock. <laughs> you love these not chatty categories. <laughs> We're <laughs> so not funny. Okay, let's start this. All right, so we have all the categories uh, in a random selection wheel. So we're just gonna randomly select and go through all of them and save games. Uh, Feast for sports is first. I'm gonna kill myself. <laughs> I mean, you got some so let's opinions. see what we get. We got we got <laughs> thirty whole categories to go ever. through in ideally an hour. Narrative. 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 All right. Um, all right. Um. Okay. Wait. Let me guess. Is uh somehow Last of Us on there? Because Last of Us Two and One Remake. So I guess it should also be said. <laughs> they some them. of us. Some of us tried to to stay unspoiled and save yeah. our reactions for the podcast. Yeah. yeah shut up, baby. Others looked. No. Uh, I Whoa. Know. They Baldur's Gate is in this category. No. Best narrative. Baldur's Gate. Wrap it up. Wrap it up. Baldur's Gate. Alan Wake, Baldur's Gate 3, Cyberpunk 2077, Phantom Liberty, 
Final Fantasy 16 and Marvel Spider Man 2. What is. Oh, Man, by the way. Is it too late for me to say. By I, the way, who, I whoever have no gets the. Because I've not played any of these games. Oh, I was going to say, whoever guesses Ethan the least has... amount possible, they like, get taken the back and shot. Vanquish so, uh... isn't on here. Vanquish got snubbed. Steven's like, where the fuck is Medal of Honor? I'm going to pull, pull, pull it up. Or Steven's is Warfighter at? Play it right nah, now. nah, that's crazy. You don't know. Know. <laughs> Let's see. Right. So one thing I'm noticing first is, uh, um, I don't know, it feels kind of... Feels weird to see Phantom Liberty on this list. Why? It's like the best. Apparently, Sweet. it's like the best story. The game like, is fixed. It is DLC. DLC. The game is fixed. Paul Tassi said so. Yeah, I, guess, I don't think... know. I guess it's just weird to see like Every... a DLC. I guess that makes You're sense. Gonna... It... It's like an expansion. Okay. It this will make sense when we get to another category where it makes zero sense why they like. Okay. I don't want to spoil like yeah. if yeah. you haven't seen it and you <laughs> care for some reason. But uh, like, I'm sure. Uh, but no, like kill you the, the way they categorize Cyberpunk. Uh, Phantom Liberty is not as a DLC. That's what? all I'll say. Okay. You'll see. You'll see when we get to that category. Dude. You're gonna be why overhaul. Okay. Uh, you'll see. Remake of the year. But so... I mean, Phantom Liberty is like if you count it as 2.0, it's pretty much just Cyberpunk re-release. Okay. Yeah. That should be best ongoing game. That's just weird. That is a that, that is, is a category. Game. <laughs> yeah, literally best ongoing game. That would be a perfect category um, for it. What's the internet's opinion on a Final Fantasy game? I remember it came uh, out. I have no idea. Like, Story wise, I, I, I just heard no skill idea. up like yeah. Zip. That's all I know. Skill up. Okay. Yeah. Okay, but that's skill up. Skill up has some. some no, that's skill up hated fucking Final Fantasy sixteen. No. He he's kind of he's mixed on it. I think. Okay. But he the really only likes one that I've five. Played. I think. Oh, sorry. So yeah, I didn't play any single one of these games like Steven either. Holy fuck. Yeah, the only one I've played out of category is, is Baldur's Gate. <laughs> and I mean, Baldur's Gate is good. I'm still in Act 1. You're on Act 1! God, this man is only on the still not line. in the Goblin camp. That's boys. crazy. No, okay. that's crazy. <laughs> but I have like, I have like 30 hours in the game. You're a menace. I don't know how you have like a quarter of my total playtime. That's because I'm a slow ass player. Oh I need to, you don't understand. I need to flip over every rock. I need to explore. I, I need to investigate every barrel, every chest. I, I like. I just like. I don't know. I'm, this I'm just is a slow uh, as this is what game development does to my fucker. Right. <laughs> Literally. Um. If I'd had uh, to choose one, what is the best narrative? Well, there's gets gonna win it. Yeah. But I'd like. I like Alan Wake to win just because it'd be cool. Yeah, I feel like a- this is like one of the categories Alan Wake can be. I think I was like, I don't think, I think I'm voting for Baldur's. I think people I, I'm voting for Baldur's Gate, Gate, but I'm voting for Alan Wake. Like I think I would, Gate I, or I would want Alan Wake to win. I think it, it it depends what you like consider a narrative as well. I, I guess how like, strong but, is the, the the recency bias with Alan Wake? I don't too. even. That's the I've thing. heard nobody yeah. talk about it. That's the thing. I've heard no one talk about it. I think too, because like Baldur's Gate is a very open narrative. Like like you can choose to participate in the story and like see all the cool stuff that happens and have it all happen. But you can also choose to just like wait, wait, wait. skip everything. And so I, wait, I'm wait, interested. Wait, 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 like wait, wait, wait. what? I was gonna say Cyberpunk has Idris Elba in it, uh, so it default wins best narrative. <laughs> Yeah. No Spider Man 2 love? I haven't played it yet. I, I well, all I've heard about Spider Man 2 is, is complaining. Terrible. You've heard I've it's terrible? I heard the story in 2 is like worse than both I don't believe all that. I, all I know is Mary Jane takes 19 inches of venom. Where do you read this maybe shit? Maybe should win after that. I, I bet, I bet, the, I bet, I bet the game's fine. I just feel like it's probably like. I don't know more of the same. It's probably this on par with the first game, or yeah, like, it's on par with the first uh, game. Well, like from what Skill Up talked about, when I assume, uh, like where the plot threads are going, it's just kind of like, you know, you like more of not more of the same, but it's like, oh, it's a symbiote story. I know these plot points are gonna happen. You know what I mean? And they have different things going for the story. I think, but, like from what I can tell, I don't know. Like, it doesn't surprise as much as people would think, I guess, you know. I don't know. I think... I'll, I'll, you know, sorry, just, go ahead. You know, this is coming from the guy with the Venom profile pictures, so, you know. Yeah. <laughs> All I was going to say is, like, 
I, uh, the only thing I've heard about the story is that it's not as good as the other two, and that Spider Man and uh, fucking what's Norman's son's name? I forget. Harry. Harry, Harry Osborn. They're both. They're just openly and gay both. with each other. Like Venom What's and Spider Man are just gay. Sorry, no, that's good. That... That's hype. How are you? you I mean, that, that bumps it negative. up for me. Sorry, yeah. The, the way you worded that, it made it seem like that's yeah. The way like you were negative. wording that, you're like, oh, gay no, I'm, no. That... That's that's fucking banger. That's that's like the plus when side. You said Norman's son. I immediately thought of uh, Norman Reedus. <laughs> Mingus! Dingus <laughs> Reedus? Mingus Reedus? Reedus? No, I'm pretty sure his first name is Mingus. Mingus. No, but yeah. what do you think his middle name is? Do you think it's oh. like Dingus? Mingus, Mingus Pingus. <laughs> Mingus Pingus. <laughs> it's a bar. Mingus, Pingus, okay, so uh, what should we, should we, wait, should we, we as a group, have a soy boys vote and we see how well we do? Yeah, 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 yeah. Make it bold. I wish I played all these games. Yeah, if, we're, okay, if we don't get to be fair, we, how are we supposed to play Spider Man Two no Alan Wake Two by now? True. It's literally like they've been out for like a week. Yeah, I got, I got, yeah. I got Alan Wake Two, you know. Yeah, on well, what? Well, yeah, go. yeah, I, I totally forgot. <laughs> I'm playing I, through Alan Wake right one right now. I totally forgot that you can like that like you can vote for for what you want to win. So 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 should, should I we... be should I be voting like just for myself here or or is this like a no no I no feel this like is the we... soy boys vote we no, no, I, this, is this, is, this is the soy boys vote if we get less than half correct I feel like we punish ourselves with something <laughs> honestly yeah we punish ourselves with edging yeah <laughs> well, wait you guys are are edging right now right yeah, yeah I'm just like gonna get I'm demonetized or something or what we don't get we half need half monetization. <laughs> Steven thinks we make money off of this. We need to wa- people need to watch <laughs> our videos. Jason needs to watch more of our videos, bro. <laughs> um, I can, you can vote for. We can they vote. Can't demonetize the zero dollars. They can't demonetize. That's actually zero true. Dollars. That's actually true. <laughs> so, okay, I mean, so they can still like, age restrict it, but yes. <laughs> if we are voting, so, yeah, what's the like? Are we voting for what we think is gonna win or what we yes. want to Majority's win? Yes. vote. Majority well, vote for us. Of what we think is gonna win. What we think is I gonna think win. Okay, yeah, so I majority of them think Baldur's Gate is going to put win. Baldur's Gate, but Baldur's I can totally I think Baldur's see Gate. it not being Baldur's Gate. I, I think it's Alan either Alan Wake. Marcella, Marcella going either. with the two possible <laughs> conclusions. I can totally yeah. see the opposite <laughs> happening. <you know. laughs> okay, okay, God, back to the wheel. Either Baldur's right? Gate or <laughs> not Baldur's Gate. There are 30, 30 more categories. <laughs> there are two oh options. This is the, I, one of the podcasts of all time. <laughs> No, I was gonna say too. Did, what, is there any games we think we're missing? Oh, fighting games! Oh, we're going fighting games next. Can you was there up, any games we thought that were missing from the narrative? These games, if you don't know what they are, that's a narrative. No, like yeah, did you like yeah, put it on? One hundred percent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can do. I that. didn't see Destiny Two: Season of the Witch on there. Okay, what's on fighting games? Like genuinely <laughs> wait, no, invested wait, what, in this. What was that? Best narrative? What, yeah, were there best any narrative. Other narrative games, I guess. Any other narrative games this year that came out that you thought uh, had like a very there's compelling too many narrative? Games. Well, there's too many indie, indie games. Kingdom. You can literally fit any indie game. video games. <laughs> um, Dave the I mean, Diver. The ones that were already there, you know. But sure. Uh, the Diver. I already know there's a game that came out this year that got super snubbed. Yeah, but Starfield. I'll, I'll bring it up when necessary. Yes, Resident Evil Four. Starfield narrative. Shut Tears up. of the Kingdom. Dead Island Two. Hey, yeah, hey, t- narrative. Good uh, one, buddy. Fire Emblem one. Engage. Okay, look, it's a Fire Emblem game. Is, Have you it's guys played Emblem- the princess? Poo-poo. I heard that's gonna. Oh, oh play the I've princess is it, a no- but... it, See, here's the thing. Are we counting like narratives towards game? No, no. Play, like, like what? Because the actual story. Like, uh, no. Well, the only play the princess is interesting. Narrative, right? It's not the. It is the best story yeah. in a game or something like that. Narrative is just all, yeah, uh, like a catch-all phrase. I guess yeah. I you know I what? If, we're, if we're counting that, then yeah, I throw Slay the, the Princess in there. Yeah, well, I throw. How about the incest game? <laughs> Wait, that came out this year. Oh yeah, oh my joke fucking god! Wait, wait, Stephen makes a good point. Coffin of Andy and Lele. Yeah. Coffin of Andy and Lele. Yeah, that deserves it a hundred percent. Wait, let's get to the fighting game. Yeah, let's look at fighting okay, games. Okay, that's, that's oh, let's talk about, talk about a category I care about. Yeah, let's okay. okay, so what are these goofy up? All right, God of Rock. So, the, so the nominees for for best fighting game is God of Rock, made by Brazilians. Doesn't count. <laughs> Damn. Okay. <laughs> uh, Mortal Please Kombat One, Nickelodeon All Stars Brawl Two. That just Brawl came 2. out. 
that just came out. Pocket Bravery. They needed a fucking fighting game. And Street Fighter Six. I mean, it's not another like add Sifu because we don't All-Star have any fighting games this year. Filed because it took away um, Hue Neutron. Yeah, it deleted Hue Neutron, so it's a it's a disqualification. Yeah, you're gonna get live Soy Boy's reaction to God of Cock. God of Rock. Wait, that's a review. It's gonna tell us what it's a. Oh, it's the rhythm fighting game. Oh, oh my god, I forgot about this. Oh, it's a rhythm fight. Wait, this looks cool as fuck. Yeah, it's not but... gonna win, but it looks cool as fuck. Okay, I gotta check this out. I'm putting this on my list. I'll put it on the list. Put it on my list. And then what Pocket was the other bravery. one? Uh, Pocket Bravery. I'm pretty sure this is like a mobile game. So. Also, feel free to cut out any of the stuff that you think is like Dead Air Morgan. Oh, I know what this is. Oh, right, this one, yes. So these, so pocket bravery, from what I understand, you can tell a little bit is they had these. What's the new geo? Oh, the Wander Swan, right? Okay. The Wander Swan is just based on like Wander no, okay, because there's sp- there's specific, um, like pocket games of uh, SNK vs. Capcom yes. games specifically, and this is what this is homage homaging. So that's why everyone's yes. okay. CB. Um, the I, what I assume I think the controls are easier. Um, it's a bit more accessible. Like instead of four buttons, it's two. You know, stuff like that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's like an homage to the old like pocket fighter games. Damn! Not only it's not only is it a, a like a pretty niche genre. It's a fucking homage to the most. Niche I, I think thing that's possible. pretty funny. It won't win, but it's cool. <laughs> I don't okay, think let's win. be honest. Is that, like, it's... Any Street Fighter Six, it's gonna win. I hope it wins. It's, I, it's, I, think we should, I was gonna say, I think it's Mortal Kombat. Like, no. I think the casual. No, I think the casual audience no, is more towards. No, 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 I mean, nah. it's MK1 MK1 or MK1 Street Fighter. MK1 still is more than Street Fighter Six, but with Street Fighter Six, I think Real, it innovates mm. more. More memes came out of MK1. No, that's true. That's that's true. the thing. Well, yeah, no, yeah. I think we've um, had pretty equal views, but I think Johnny Cage is still pretty. It's funnier than your average I... Cage is a better Street Fighter meme. 6 character. <laughs> uh, Virch- I think we should ask Rachella what he thinks the best fighting game here. Yeah, Rachella, what fighting game now do you gotta show Street Fighter you 6? But you show Nick- I could totally see it being... M- show him Nickelodeon. Nickelodeon. I think it's a big one. Thank you. Rachella, Rachella show- you can provide <laughs> the <laughs> value of feedback. Show him Nickelodeon <laughs> Officer Brawl 2, and then I think he'll change his mind. Uh, I like Street Fighter 6 more. I I don't know if it would beat MK1. See, that's the thing. I think so I know. I think I think I think MK1 wins. That's the thing. It's a better game, better but like mechanics mm. too. Um, the roster isn't. No, I, as, I don't think isn't, isn't as good. But um, I also think MK has the recency bias. That's for true. sure. True. No, but I don't. It hundred percent has the recency. I don't bias. think. I don't think it'll well, win. Uh, sure. I think Chris? Street Fighter Six. I, 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 I think Street Fighter 6 should win. I don't know if it will win. It should. It should. No, uh, I think it will. I'm voting for Street Fighter 6. I think yeah. it's going to win it. Sure. I think it's going to win it. Damn, that flip flop from 6 to uh, I played one, one fighting game, and he's like, yeah, I think Street Fighter 6 is going to win. We just watch more. I played one. both of them! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You didn't even finish the story mode for MK1, you That's fraud! True. I didn't finish the story mode for Street Fighter 6 either. <laughs> you but fraud. I will one of these days. One of these okay, days to be fair, the, the story mode for Street Fighter 6 is like an actual like campaign. You want to finish the actual them? gameplay? So what what are the what are the fighting games that got snubbed this Tekken year? Eight. Uh Tekken 8. Yeah, Tekken 8. Dong Dong never they, die. They tried more that God. came out this year. I cannot I ch- did, I genuinely um, cannot think. Uh, come out? Uh, the Grand Blue oh, Fantasy yeah, versus Rising uh, open beta. Yeah, the open beta for Grand Blue Terror Fantasy Dome versus Rising. Or whatever it's called, the indie horror fighting game. Um, <laughs> there's probably a few. Let's go to the next one. Oh my god! I can't. We're doing every category. We're gonna fucking. Some, Some of these categories we're gonna have like nothing. I will fall. Fucking like, gooning intermission. Oh, here we go. All right. Here we Community go. support. Community support. Community. I'm support. voting Destiny two. Hundred percent. Here it is. Okay, Best I actually don't know the other games support. though. So the nominees are Cyberpunk is Baldur's insane. Baldur's Gate three. Cyberpunk twenty seventy seven. Can you read the description of what this means? 
Destiny 2, Final no, Fantasy do 14, and No Man's Sky. Man's Sky How is No Man's Sky still there, getting bro. nominated to okay, this wait, year? Wait. So the, the, the description says, Recognizing a game for outstanding community support, transparency, and responsiveness. What the fuck are they on here? Inclusive <laughs> of social media activity okay. and game updates slash patches. Why the fuck is okay, Destiny 2 so, on here? So you know, okay, so I'm it's a right community man. They're not, they don't, know, they don't t- say shit. What do you mean? There's a lot of everyone. Look, they're gone now. Okay, here's the thing. Gets laid off. (laughs) Here's the thing. All I'm gonna say is, um, Bungie did release that post where they're like, "We want Frogger type gameplay." Bungie's a complete black box. Or frog type gameplay. What did they put in that one post that confused all of us? Frog type game. (laughs) Yeah, frog type game. Yeah. Oh my god! Why'd you remind me of that? I still don't know what the hell that means. (laughs) I forgot Bungie's <laughs> making a frog type game. Frog type. Game? What does that mean? It's a marathon killer. Uh, okay. In all seriousness, I I'm gonna vote. I think I think it'll win, and I'm gonna vote for it uh, in <laughs> FF14. FF14, FF14 always, always, always wins. Because yeah. yeah, that's the it's the it's well it's the only option that makes sense. Yeah. I, I mean, want Baldur's Gate three. Baldur's Gate three so, maybe yeah. So I guess we're... I feel like Baldur's Gate three and Cyberpunk can both win. Hell out of Baldur's Gate three, it's pretty hype. Um, and Cyberpunk. Is. They were pretty through early access as well. This is okay. This this category is literally Twitter. Like yeah, which, who won Twitter? Which game was on Twitter the most? And I feel like like oh, most of these were. Yeah, I, I did not see No Man's Sky on Twitter. Maybe not. I I didn't see No Man's Sky either. It still confuses me that No Man's Sky keeps getting nominated for awards to this day. What that game think? came out. It's an ongoing like, game. Wait, when did that game come out? Like two thousand. 2017? Oh, yeah. Bungie came out. I reckon Destiny 2 came out like six years ago. Yeah, well, this one, this one is Bungie straight up paying Jeff Keighley. Let's be honest here. Yeah, Pete Parsons. No, Bungie does have did the, have the a good community. Uh, yeah, before they Bungie f- to uh, lay off everyone. Yeah. Yeah, shout out to when they posted about that Latinx stuff, well, and that's why everyone got mad at them. How do the winners uh, just... get chosen for this shit? It's uh, it's like seventy percent, I think, fan vote, and then like. There's a no, it's not 70%. No, it's it's not the other 70. way around. Is it 50-50? Sure. Uh, is it like 30? 30% fan vote and then it's the the judges they have or whatever? Mm-hmm. It's something like that. And even then, I don't think the fan vote is that big. I think fan a, vote's like 15%. It's a bad taste in people's mouths for Destiny 2 right now. Mm. But that's that's why low-key I kind of want Destiny to win. To be mm-hmm. like, like, an, like fuck a, you, you. We're so back <laughs> moment? Is this the we're <laughs> no, so back? A, no, no, it's like a fuck you, you fired all the people that got you this award. <laughs> that's true. Yeah, no, that's the joke. Like that. That's what everybody's saying. Everybody's saying vote D2. Good way to look at it. To say fuck you to Bungie. Okay, yeah, good point. So, I like that. I'm vote, uh, let's vote Destiny 2. Okay, I well, I guess I'm getting voted. Like, <laughs> me and yep, Steven probably up. get voted out. Morgan. I hate the fucking D2 players in this <laughs> in this call. Yeah, 3 to 2, bitch. Sorry, I, I, I'm a fan of flipping off Bungie. Sorry. Yeah, that's why you continue playing their game. Marathon killer. I put too much money to stop. Aztec Rod. <laughs> okay, well, you're just... Okay. Mar- oh, family game. I see that family. Family game. <laughs> family game. <laughs> Thank you, Rachel. <laughs> wait, what? Wait, wait, boys. What got snubbed from uh? What got oh, snubbed from the void community? Mm, okay, like, we can only we can bring stuff oh, up. No, I was joking. I was joking. Mean. That was a joke. Just go oh, back. Gee. It's gotta be picked. All right, so it. best family game is. I think there's one choice. Illusion here. Island. Party Animals. Pikmin 4, Sonic Superstars, Mario and Mario Super Brothers. Mario Brothers, Mario Brothers. Wonder. I Mario love Brothers. these so Like I actually played... I, I played a bit of Party Animals. I did it. It's a really fun game. But, like, Mario's winning this, let's be honest. Mario's absolutely winning this. I, I, I agree with you, Steven. I love Ochi, but, like, is Pikmin... Like, do kids play Pikmin? Like, I feel like Pikmin is, like enjoyed by adults and like teenagers yeah. at this point like, i feel like children don't like see pikmin on the shelves and they're like that's the game no, that's not what this category is it's a family i know game. it's, it's family game, but game. still but for the most part it's like you, you it's just a way to say kids game pikmin 4 is probably yeah but most, like in, in my opinion it's probably the most interesting game here well actually that's not oh true, i i agree my brother's wonder mm-hmm. probably looks fire i just haven't played it yeah. Mario Wonder. Honestly, all four of these, like, like with the exception of Disney Illusion Island. There's like, five. The, the, the four, <laughs> besides Disney, 
Yeah, it's pretty the, bangers. No, Illusion Island is oh, also a Illusion Island platformer like uh, Superstars and Wonder. Yeah, I, I just know nothing about it. Illusion Island actually looks kind of fun. Part, okay, part, just a heads up. Party Animals is basically better um, gang beasts. That's what it is. Yeah. No, I mean, like, Mario Wonder is winning this. <laughs> Mario Wonder is winning this. <laughs> Mario uh, Wonder we got is stuff from this, is. boys. Uh, I don't, I, I don't know. Nothing comes to the top, top of my head. Uh, don't, we don't have to yeah. bring up snub every time. If there's a game you think of, <laughs> yeah, is bring it up. I, I, I agree with what I'm just, it, it, it's a joke. It's a joke. <laughs> but uh, what do we? So, so are, are we voting Mario Wonder? Sonic Super Mario Mario Marcello, what do, what do you have to say about this? Marcello yeah, plays this is, a lot this of these. This is a very Marcello core. I played uh, Mario selection. Bros. Wonder, so that one wins. <laughs> you played Mario Wonder? We think we played it at PAX. Oh yeah. shit! You're right. This guy keeps forgetting about packs. Every time I bring up packs, he's like, "Oh wow, he did go to pack." <laughs> so yeah, n- next time, next time I'll bring a, uh, I'll bring a camera and we'll record a big fancy vlog video oh, for the Soy Boys. Yeah. I, I'd, I'd rather die. <laughs> I'd rather die. What do you mean? We get the shot of us taking off through the airplane window, and then the shot of us landing through the airplane and window, the, and then the shot of Marcello stealing my goddamn then, seat on the plane. Yo, yeah, the shot of us, like, you know, like the shot of us riding like through the city on a bus, and the cameras looking out the window as it's going by, everything and like lo-fi music is Can playing we get in the background. Game? Okay, this guy's right. is not funny anymore. Up next, it is was funny. Uh, fucking oh, Baldur's Gate. <laughs> Gate. Baldur's Outstanding Gate. online. No, I think this is a category about Baldur's Gate can lose. Outstanding yeah. online multiplayer gameplay and design, including co-op and massively multiplayer experiences, irrespective of game genre or platform, is what it is. Yeah. Oh, and it's sponsored by Discord. Street Fighter Six. I think Diablo. So, well, well, let's let's so so the so the. The nominees are Baldur's Gate 3, Diablo 4, Party Animals, Street Fighter 6, and Mario Wonder. Discuss. I think it's Wonder. He's gonna win this Actually, one. Wonder's online multiplayer is really fun. Really? I have nothing- I know nothing about its online multiplayer. What is it? So, I'm not so, sure. So how it works- It's a strand-type game. It's a oh, strand-type right. game. Ba- basically- when you're playing a level, it'll grab people who are playing the level at the same time, and you'll see, like, their silhouettes moving across the level. And then you or the other players can leave behind, like, cardboard cutouts, and uh, if you die, you turn into a ghost, and if you touch one of the cardboard cutouts left behind by another player, you get a revive. Additionally, if you touch someone else who's playing through the level as a ghost, you also get revived. And it's just, it's, it's really fun. I've actually, like made a couple friends on Nintendo Online just by, like, running into him in Mario Wonder and helping each other through levels. There's also... You can leave notes like Dark Souls. <laughs> you can. Um, um, so it's also I think it's Wonder or Diablo 4. Like, is it, like, kind of... I think Diablo 4 could die, win this. It's a player? It's an MMO, though, like they said. In, in Mario Bros.? Or is it, like, at the same time? It's a strand type yeah, game. Yeah, see, that's the thing. Like, no, that, no, it's like, no, it's like Souls, Marcello. Yeah, I know, but that, oh, okay, like that's that, 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 they're ghosts. It's like you see, time. you see people playing. Yeah, it's yeah. a ghost in real time. Is what it is. Yeah. That's, that's uh, um, I mean, I think Street Fighter Six could also. That's. Be, a, yeah. I, I was gonna say Street Fighter Six also has an argument for this. Yeah, because like the lobby, people just people just battling in the with their that's custom cool. avatars. That's cool. Yeah. The online lobbies are really sick. Fuck. I honestly it's like as big. fun as Mario Wonder is, like in the multiplayer is. I I think it's between Diablo Four, or Street Fighter Six. I'm I'm personally going Street Fighter Six. I think I would go Street Fighter Six only because I played that game more than Diablo. That's 4. crazy. <laughs> I only have like two hours in Diablo Four. Also, like I don't know. I'm just imagining like ads for Diablo Four. That's like winner of best multiplayer, and like that pisses me off. Pisses me off. I don't know why. That just uh, the idea of that pisses me off. That being vindictive about fucking you award just voting. A funny guy. <laughs> so, right, I, so I, voting. I'm voting Street Fighter Six. I, I vote Street Fighter Six. All right. I don't know. No, nothing crazy yep. about Diablo multiplayer, honestly. It's like, it just. Yeah. I mean, it's just. It's doesn't standard. Diablo always have multiplayer? But this one's an MMO, right? It's not regular co-op. Yeah. No, it's the same why thing. do they say this one's right, an MMO uh, and the other ones aren't? I mean, it has MMO, more ele- MMO elements. Like, it has public events and stuff like that. Yeah. Alright, what do we think got snubbed? Oh, uh, fucking Call of Duty, Duty Mo- Modern Warfare so 3. So true. 
I'm kidding. We're biggest going next category. Modern Warfare Zombies. Let's speed this up for the sleeper categories. All right, best best sports uh, 2K, 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 2K,
And uh, okay. on bum, to the next bum, category. Bum, bum. Yeah. Oh, what is it? What is it? VR AR. Oh VR. my god. Whoa, okay, I, I gotta category. I gotta keep myself in check. <laughs> All right, call it? the mountain. Well, also, yeah, for for the people listening, the podcast, if it's no. if it's not obvious already, we're we're using a, a wheel to pick our options. We said that at the beginning of the video. <laughs> we just go, we were, we're gonna go sure back and check. That's gonna be very funny. I'm pretty sure in the beginning we just said that we're randomly selecting. I don't think we said how, but maybe we did. Okay, so Ooh, VR. the uh, the nominees for best VR AR is Gran Turismo Seven, Horizon Call of the Mountain. Humanity. Oh, I, that game actually looked kind of cool. I didn't see anything it did. from it though. Uh, Resident Evil Going Village VR mode and Synapse. I don't even know what that one is. Uh Synapse. I'm pretty. I'm pretty sure it's made by the Synapse. guys that are doing that. Uh, like, just, Far Cry, like the Far Cry VR. Just, just vote Horizon. So, VR, uh, call them on. It's an absolute good. I'm looking. Yeah. As the one guy. Yeah, who remember we saw this and yeah, yeah, has yeah. been actually keeping yeah, up with VR that news. Yeah, we kept seeing uh, Synapse was good, but I was gonna say running. that's about it. I mean, humanity is not a VR only game. Like so Resident Evil also has stupid. well, I don't know why it it's on here. VR <clears throat> enabled. That's the thing. Like Resident Evil Village VR though, it's actually like better than regular <laughs> Resident Evil Village. I will say that, but just put just vote Horizon. Yeah, are these all VR? Yeah, like, are next. these all PSVR two games? Category. All right. Is that the one? Yeah. Like, yeah, cause it's a, yeah, it's Horizon. Yeah, it'll probably win. I Y'all literally hate, hate video. I hate all of you, to be honest. RPG, uh, Persona, uh, Baldur's Gate. Yeah, I wonder, so. which, I wonder what's gonna win here. Okay, so the nominees for best RPG are Baldur's Gate Three, <laughs> Star Final King. Fantasy Sixteen, Lies of P. Oh shit! See the Star Sea of, of Stars or C Starfield. Of Personally, my money's on Starfield. Well, Starfield's there. <laughs> so, isn't it sad that Starfield isn't going to win which, RPG? Which it's not going to win any game. It's not going to win any it's category. Win any it's category. Best game. Oh. RPG, best RPG. Best it's RPG. It's going to be Baldur's, right? It'd be based on the Stars one. Very, yeah. the only thing. very funny if Starfield won. Yeah, well, well, so here's the thing. The only way that I could see Baldur's Gate not winning this category is this if that no, Jeff it, gets his it's if off. it's if Baldur's Gate the wins game way. of the year and they feel like throwing a bone to a different game for this category they're not gonna do that they're not no, they don't do they, that that's, they don't remember do that. we had never do was that. it so last of us two that swept go, everything ah well, uh, true they don't throw bows they're just yeah they just they, they just let whoever votes wins well my money's on starfield personally you're <laughs> I think okay. so too. Yeah, isn't that sad? Just I mean, like, but does the game they got doesn't even win RPG of the year? Isn't that crazy? You know, it's their first new IP in like thirty years, and it's whatever. They've just been making Skyrim for like ten years. Yeah, so. the problem is it's just Skyrim in space. <laughs> they don't know how to make anything but Skyrim now. What have you played in Everest? Have you no. played Skyrim? That's no, what I thought. I'm a fake fan. Actually, no, I did play Skyrim. I played it for like an hour when I was like. 13. I think I, I, I like ran <laughs> away wild. from the dragon at the beginning and then and then I stopped playing. I think I like So you played by, like five minutes then. I got like mauled by a bear or something, I can't remember. Uh but my my, my, my money's actually on Baldur's Gate. Are we all in agreement on Baldur's Gate? Yes. Yeah. Like I don't think it was we <laughs> dragged that on way too long. Dan, sorry I'm trying to talk in a podcast. <laughs> I'll do right here. Look, we're trying to we're trying to speed run before Steve Kill falls asleep. Man. Impact, okay. G- like Games for Impact. Is Genshin in this? Uh, wrong Genshin kind of better impact. be in this fucking Genshin Impact. The game of the year. Wrong kind of impact. All right, Games for <coughs> Impact. Did we play any of these? So that we got uh, <laughs> Space for the Unbound, uh, Chance of Sanar, Goodbye Volcano <laughs> High, <laughs> to 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 Chia Chia. Uh, I don't know how to pronounce that. Terra Nil and Venba. Uh, I'm just gonna say it. I don't. I don't. I'm gonna say. I don't think it deserves the the award at all. But sure. I don't know. It's like it's like saying Last of Us or sorry, not Last of Us. Uh, what is it? Life is Strange deserves games for impact. I was gonna say, what impact is is Volcano High? Like I just thought it was like a teenage melodrama. The only thing it has impact on is that someone somehow made 
like a fan game making fun of it before this came out. And like this game has been in yeah. development forever. Haters, haters' motivation go crazy. Oh, I think we vote. It's like the volcano high. The, old, yeah, the, one. the problem is that's oh, the only yeah, one yeah. I know of. Okay, wait. I'm gonna look up Terra Nil because that no one chance. sounds familiar. Yeah, goodbye volcano high is the only one I actually like know. Out of that's all the thing. These, which this is, is sad. more. This is more of a a huh? Yeah. Oh, I think I know. I oh develop the Terra Nil. Oh, is I developer? well that's public Netflix. Right? Yeah. And it's Netflix Actually, game? That's kind of hype. Wait, I Apparently know Netflix games are going hard. Have you seen the Netflix games? They're kind of crazy. I. Yeah, They're actually, no space for the Undone. It. it looks really interesting. What is it? Uh, It's like a like it's a 2D exploration. Like, just kind of like walk around. Cool. Interact cool. with stuff. I think puzzly elements. I mean, this, poster, I this poster for Chia makes it look pretty cool. This, that poster for Chia makes it look like a Disney like ripoff movie poster. What do you well, mean? I, mean? I feel like that's what they're going for. Like I feel that like looks like Reta toying. God damn, you're a hater. Holy shit. I am. And Don't forbid, tell me I'm wrong though. Heaven forbid Don't this game try to make an impact with its garbage poster. Yeah, sure. Poster looks fine. <laughs> like it looks so inoffensive. I don't... No, there's just so much black <laughs> space that I hate it. There's just a lot of black space, negative space. T- it's... All right. I'm glad you clarified there. <laughs> <laughs> what? Uh, let's just, I guess, Volcano High, sure. Yeah. Terra no, Nil, yo, I can literally download it. Let's just go Terra Nil, because it's funny. I mean, no, no, but... Whatever, uh, that's one of our throwaway boats. We don't need to get everything right. I mean, from, like, what I saw of Volcano High, it didn't, like, it looked standard. Terra Nil looks interesting. Go next. Okay, spin that goddamn wheel. Yo, Narcos Cartel Wars Unlimited. <laughs> that, might, so that got snubbed. <laughs> yeah, if you go to your uh, Netflix game direction. App, Here we go. Him. My money's on Hideo Kojima. Yo. I can play the Queen's Gambit. Oh, wait, chess. you're looking for a good Netflix I've never played game? that game. Play Point P. What the fuck is Point P? It's a banger game. Ask Sebastian about it. Oh, Hello Sebastian Kitty and Friends it. is on here. Point P? He, he's a beast at Point P. Best uh, game Alan direction. Too. Yeah, I find it inter- I always find it interesting how the game direction category lists the games instead of the directors. But yes. Also, I'm gonna. I'm not. I'm sorry. My brain's a little demented. Every time I see the, the Nintendo EPD on there, yeah. I th- I read it as EDP. I th- thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Best game direction uh, though. Alan Wake, Baldur's really? Gate three. Spider-Man 2, Mario Bros. Wonder, or Tears of the Kingdom. Okay, for direction, I think the reason why they state the studio more than anything is also just because it's like a whole team. Well, it is. That's true. It, it is a team of direction. directors, but but still, I just, like... I don't know. I mean, <laughs> it, like, it's not it just the directors, it's weird. also like... I don't know. I, mm. No, no, like, I, I get what you're saying, but it, it still just feels weird. Like, even if they just did, like, a list of the directors or whatever, but, yeah. I, I get it, though. It's it's also just to, like, simplify it for, for people who don't care about the directors, because 90% of the people who look at these categories and vote are, like, just random people who watch the Game Awards for the for the game announcements and nothing Quick, else. name me a director that isn't Hideo Kojima or Neil Druckmann. You lose. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me that. <clears throat> Tell me that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tell me stupid I, I think, lies. God, I, I think I think it's just uh, I think it's Alan Wake. Game direction. I could definitely see it being Alan Wake. Yeah. I it's see it no, I think it's Baldur's. I think it's, uh, Baldur's it's definitely game. between Alan Wake or Baldur's for me. I think it's Baldur's for game direction and but design. Alan Wake I think is it's so gonna be Baldur's. Style. Yeah, it's so. It, that's the thing. It's visually. Yeah, but I think Baldur's Gate is gonna win it because they're like, oh, it's so big. It's like a big game. Yeah, but that's that's why it wins RPG. That's why it wins RPG and Game of the Year. Okay, well, my vote is for Alan Wake. I think Alan Wake. Steven, you're the tiebreaker here. Oh, God, he's actually asleep. Oh, my God, he's actually asleep. Steven, if you're talking, you're muted. You ever get that shit at work? Okay, uh... <laughs> hey, Steven, what are you voting for? <laughs> yeah, what the fuck? Holy Fortnite shit. got snubbed! 
Holy shit, for it, I got snubbed oh, for yeah, the best what's, game direction. What's that guy, Mustard? <laughs> the, yeah, Donald Mustard is the guy that... The, he's like one of the Fortnite guys. Alright, Annie. <clears throat> Alan Wake or Baldur's Gate? Okay, Annie specify, says Baldur's did you Gate. you specify game that's direction? A that's a tiebreaker. Game direction. Is your, will it still count? Why is game direction? Like a director. Baldur's Gate. <laughs> Alright, you Walk know what? So, since we can't come to an agreement, we're going Tears of the Kingdom. I'm kidding. Fine, we'll go Baldur's Gate. Whatever. You guys are going to be rolling on the floor when you're wrong. I think we might be halfway. He's literally sleeping. Steven's literally Anticipated game. Grave. The most important category. The most worthless award. Take an A. Take an A. Take an A. Take, take an A. Take an A. Take an A. Take an A. Take an a, take an a, take an a. Oh, oh, oh. That's adaptation. Well, no. This 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 bottom year, up, bottom it's up, actually like a... A contest because all right T-O- most T-O-T-K, anticipated though. game we got final fantasy 7 rebirth boring hades oh hades 2. also might be up there hades 2 up there like a dragon infinite wealth uh star wars outlaws boring and uh tekken 8 I, I like my personal my personal vote would go towards like a dragon infinite wealth but like it's either Hades 2 or Tekken 8. Okay, My so personal vote is by Morgan. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up! Is it? That should be a category. <laughs> I think... Yeah, I it. think... I think if we actually want to win the category, we put oh, Final Fantasy 7 oh, and my... we just go next. Mm. I'm about to say he's like, even. Outlaws look crazy. No, Outlaws Outlaws look sick. I, 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 Shut I, up. Wait, I thought it was. I don't think it looks like Sean. Outlaws looks like a Ubisoft game. <clears throat> that's a good one. I think too. we literally. No, no, no. <laughs> I, I, I just said like, my most that's, anticipated that's personally is Hades Bob. 2, but Wait, obviously man. this is not most anticipated game by Everest category. <laughs> <laughs> Roll so, thirds, baby. Roll thirds. The question is honestly, probably like it'll probably be Final Fantasy 7. Will win the pop because I think this is one of the categories that's entirely dictated by popular vote. Yeah, and, it'll probably be fa- Final and, Fantasy. And, and Normies love schlock, so Final Fantasy VII will probably win. I mean, if Normies love schlock, by that rule, Star Wars should win. <laughs> I hope Hades. Also, wins, I, I don't. I don't actually think that. I was. I was. I mean, I do, but I. I don't want people to actually. I'm. I'm keeping in the, yeah. in the official, <laughs> official <laughs> recording. So. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, we're, we're, I'm assuming. We're, 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 did we decide on Final Fantasy VII? I just kind of voted yeah, for go it. Next. Wait, what are you yeah. guys? You're telling me Persona Three Reloads not on so this you're list? You're telling me what? Oh my you're right. Oh my god! I'm actually kind of surprised because like, That's, do you want to talk about anything that you think got snubbed from that category, Morgan? I just said Persona Three <laughs> Reloads. <laughs> you fucking idiot. <laughs> oh yeah, I agree. Persona Three Reloads yeah. is gonna be awesome. That's definitely one of my most anticipated games. Set it for uh, that. Personally, right. Grand Blue, I guess. Ah, uh, here we go. The first esports category. Look, I have Cindy Man, got snubbed from this. That's all I'm going to say. I don't even know this? if it's on here. Are you awake for this, know. Steven? Steven's getting water. He's we getting got, water. I think so the nominees for best esports event uh, is 2023 League of Legends World Championship. It's probably going to be League or Blast D- <laughs> Blast.TV Paris Major 2023. That's the CSGO, the, the Evo, last CSGO major. Evo 2023. The International Dota 2 Championships 2023. Or the Valorant Champions 2023. I would say... Right. I mean... There's women... Literally. No, I see yeah, one there's, woman. There's I, see, women I, know, I see three. I see four. She's the most boring-ass image for the League of Legends one. Right? Yeah, right? <laughs> it's not even them holding the trophy. Um... Uh-oh. I'm gonna vo- I'm, wait. I think we should vote the Valorant Champions 2023 because oh, so I was there. Oh, so true. You were there. there. That was so true. He's right. Oh wait, it's because oh, wait, it's because go Worlds is still going on, right? <laughs> yeah, no, I'm just saying take a they're they're, they're, they're doing an award a for a show that's venue. not like a, for a vet that's not even finished yet. To be fair, to be fair, I'm pretty sure Worlds wins like usually wins this category, <laughs> and it's yeah. always it's always like the voting period is always when it's like in the middle of running. So uh, yeah, what's what's the vote here? I I, I mean, genuinely do not care about any of these. <laughs> I said. I would say I would say like Evo, but like yeah. 
I mean, Evo, let's be real, though. I would also say Evo, but Evo is never going to win this category. Yeah, but Leffen won the... I, I, I guess Leffen won Guilty Gear, so it doesn't count. What? Yeah, that's Pokemon. Good, good. <laughs> she owns part of, She is a part owner of Evo, yes. Really? Yes. Just go to right, Valo. Just, just, go to the next category? just go Valo. I I only have like one funny story for like one of the esports related. Chris there. <laughs> <laughs> you go. Let's go to the right. <laughs> oh, No, I'll, t- I'll tell it when we get okay, to this it. This is That's actually a good category. Yes. Grand Turismo. Grand Turismo. Grand Turismo. It's Kino. Spin the it's Kino. It deserves it. The nominees. Like are, Castlevania, is Castlevania Nocturne, one. Gran Ooh. Turismo, The Last of Us, or Gran Turismo movie, I should, I should uh, uh, specify. Yes. <laughs> the Last of Us TV show, the Super Mario Bros. movie. <laughs> Who put Twisted, Twisted Metal here? <laughs> Twisted Metal TV show. Twisted Metal. Twisted so, Metal Fire. And, yeah, and, crazy. and lastly, uh, the I, last so, is Arcane I, with I've, a steel I've, chair. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh... Yeah, nah, I said I was watching Twisted Metal really 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 Get Fam yesterday. I, I, I just know about the back show. Really song good. joke in there, it's fire. Yeah, what do you mean? <laughs> you didn't think it was a good show? I just yeah. Mac the word go. <laughs> yeah, Morgan. <laughs> what, what was it? What was it? That's going to be the, the, the last of us. To... Anthony Mackie, P.O.B. Doggy Solid. Diva SFM. No, is it? With sound. Yeah. With sound. Yeah. With sound. With sound. With sound. With sound. Uh, okay. <laughs> when you're editing this, can you put the picture of of, of Anthony Mackie taking back shots so so yes. the people watching know what we're talking about? <laughs> Okay, can I'll you do you one better. You, can you put the meme I'll of the guy one, going up to accept the award? I'll do you one better. Uh, I'll do like a cropped Rule 34 of Diva doggy style POV with sound, and I'll make sure it's Anthony no. Mackie's voice. It's like demonetized. No, put... From Sweet Tooth, oh. yeah. Uh, okay, but for real... Why do you think he's called Sweet Tooth? It, it All be... I know is that if Super Mario Bros. movie wins, I'm going is to vomit Trismo? on the floor. Is it Gran Turismo, Last Let's of Us, be or Super Mario Bros? That's the, the Game question. Awards loves The Last of Us. The Last of Us. If Jeff was based, it would be Twisted Metal or Gran Turismo. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> it's... My unorthodox uh, rabbi. And it, and it sucks, too, because... Like <laughs> The Last of Us was honestly a good show. I just I just don't like it because everyone everyone likes it. Like it, it's just so popular. Like it, it was genuinely a good show. You're like, so like, fucking annoying. I know. You're next. I know I am. Yeah, but it's just okay. like ah. Uh, it's just like yeah. Ah! No, again. So I don't want to be the annoying? single fan of this. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Here's here's why it bothers me that it's gonna win best adaptation it, because it's like it's like the equivalent of like the Beatles winning oh best my music God, artist. Shut it's up. like oh, of course, shut of course up. they'd win. What? Yeah, oh. I can have some personality. <laughs> literally, literally, I mean, ah, he you, 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 <laughs> God, I'm not educated. I'm not educated. I, don't, like, you're, you're <laughs> I heard Castlevania Nocturne's pretty good. I, yeah, Tech and Bloodline wasn't even there. That's crazy. Yeah. But you're right. I oh, think the other sorry, ones are they just... I ain't voting for Everest. That's, I'll tell content, you what. I, content so creator of the year. Laser beam. We have we have Iron Isn't Mouse. Uh, don't know who that is. Wait, people make games? People kind make of... games. Literally do not know any of these Oh, games. People Make Games is based. People Make Games makes banger videos. Who's Quack? Uh, I'm actually City? really happy they got nominated. Uh, Quack is... I uh, don't know That's who he said. is. Spreen. <laughs> don't know who he is. Cypher PK, don't know. I'm who voting he Cypher. Is. I'm I'm What's literally on Fortnite on my Switch right now. You don't know. What's that? The last nomination is Marcello from Soy Boys. <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit, rare. <laughs> yeah, for for his for 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 part eight thousand seventy six of Fallen New Vegas. <laughs> that fucking power chocolate. <laughs> another uh, another year, another uh, no German nomination. Right. Feels bad. Good. Uh, I'm just gonna say it. Like Iron Man, like, Iron Man, Iron Mouse is probably gonna win the vote because VTuber. Yeah, true. Oh my god, drop drop a link to that VTuber uh, video. This is how people make games. <laughs> yeah. Quack City, Quackity is, is part Quackity... of like the Dream SMP crew. Oh. I think, if I remember. Did you know Dream SMP? 
Okay. I can't wait for Quackity fans Quack to City. hunt us down and kill us because I got that wrong. Literally. His name's like Quack yeah, City. We, we have that big of a fan base. You don't know. Maybe the two of our like Yo, two Jason. Of the fans we have are big. <laughs> yeah, maybe Jason's a say big for Quackity fan. Yeah, shout out Who's Jason. Uh, my favorite Fortnite streamer. Is, is yeah. that what he is? Oh, he's a or Fortnite a YouTuber, streamer. Okay, yeah. yeah, I was gonna ask. Who the fuck is Cypher Yeah, PK, he's got a okay, skin in I'm... Fortnite. Who's who's Spring? I don't know. making games. All right, yeah. I I, I, I I would really like for people to make people make games to win because they, they I actually do watch them and they make really good. Yeah, content. but they're popular, like, it's, so it's... they shouldn't win. <laughs> so true. I guarantee you, they're probably. Yeah, now that they've won content <laughs> of the year, I don't know if I like them as much. In this category. I don't know, like. I, I was liking their videos, and then they won. Now they're like literally so. the fucking beaters. <laughs> I don't know. I think I don't like them anymore. I'm sorry, but that's like the most Morgan contrarian take of all no, time. No, no, I know. I know that I, 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 I know that I'm awful, but I just like, I can't help the way I feel about that kind of stuff. It just, it just, the it just like, chemistry. like, yeah, it literally just like, like, <laughs> I was gonna say it eats me out from the inside, but that sounds kind of. Hey, yo. <laughs> what did it eats he me mean? Up. Yeah. It eats me up, Everest. It eats me out from the inside. It sucks me the fuck. Up it the eats inside. me out from the inside. It, it gives me sloppy. I, what is, I'm what is it, Marcella? I've been, I've been. <laughs> that but games, both people make games. Uh, I didn't go. see Plum Corp records. Shut next up. Category. That's true, actually. That's very true. <laughs> the fuck? It's okay, one of these years, Soy Boys will make it. Talk about snub. <clears throat> I guarantee you. You know what? Quote this. Ten years from now, when we're all eighty, and and Soy Boys Ten gets years nominated. from now, when we're eighty. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, we're actually all so old. Hey, where's your wife? What's your family? <laughs> Dude, what the fuck? All right, best, best sim strategy. This Pokemon. is wait, boys, uh, boys. Very the category we're very. Boys, Pokemon got snubbed from the best content creator. I'm pretty sure she's been nominated. Best deep fake uh, category. Sick. All right, best <laughs> sim strategy. We got Advance Wars One Plus Two Reboot Camp. We got City Skylines 2, Big Company Chief of Heroes Gamer. 3, Fire Emblem Engage, or Pikmin 4. How did Nintendo get uh, three nominations? It's... That's crazy. Man, Halo there Wars really 2 got no snubbed. Sim games There's two <laughs> sim games. There were Company really of no... Heroes 3 There's came two sim out? There was really no sim out. games. I didn't even yeah, know right? that was a thing. Okay, <laughs> well, I know... I heard City yeah. Skylines can barely run on, like, super yeah, computers. I, heard so get so it, I don't know if I want to vote for that one. I don't speak poor. Um, Me and running this on my I 1070. Mean... <laughs> yes. um, Chris is on 1070. I mean, honestly... Alright, do we engage. vote engage or Pikmin 4? I think Engage no, has the I th- bigger pull. I think Pikmin 4, 4 I think so. has a shot. It has a shot, but I think I think it's Fire Emblem. Do you pick one for? Yeah, that's because you're a Fire Emblem fan. I'm <laughs> well, no, it's not because of that, because it's also... It, Fire Emblem <clears> has the <throat> Weeb audience, too. True, but this is also voted. This isn't just voted by by fans. This is also... most most games journalists are weebs now. Everest. Yeah, well, I hope you know that. Actually, this is true. best Everest Sim strategy game. But also, <laughs> but, but, but Pikmin yeah, so Four. We got, actually, we got two votes for Pikmin um, Four. Actually, one vote for Fire Emblem. Actually, what's what's the gonna vote for? Company of Heroes. I don't know. No, I got Ochi. <laughs> yeah, you gotta just throw my Fire... of it. Fire Emblem in game because I match. Marcello doesn't care. <laughs> yeah, Ike. <laughs> <laughs> no, Marcel would be like that. That looks like Five Nights at Freddy's. Are we going to Fire Emblem? Right, Is cut that, that. The popular vote. <laughs> no, I'm not cutting that. Every time you say Pikmin Four, four <laughs> Marcel, Marcel is realizing he's like shit. I don't want to say that. What, what did he say? Oh, no, you got to keep that in there. You just got to censor it when he does it. <laughs> Steven, Steven, just just uh just rewind like a minute, and you'll be able to hear what he said. Yeah, so true. <laughs> Yeah, I'm alive check the vod. Yes. Check the vod. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so sorry, I still don't have a consensus. Is it? A- uh, do the uh, Ochi because Pick I mashed four, into the dog. Hey yo! Okay, I'm definitely not. Hey yo! Give me that. Give me that. We're not cutting that. Oh, I'm not cutting any of that. Cut that, <laughs> no, we oh, got best. Ongoing. Here we go. Ongoing. Here you go. 
So remember that? Remember, remember when Steven was what like, "Where'd be funny?" I don't know. Oh, in this category. Yeah. It doesn't even matter how hard you try. What the fuck? It's in that. Okay, this is this is why that com- This is why this is what I was talking okay. about earlier. So, <laughs> they put so Cyberpunk the under best Apex ongoing Legends, for some reason. Cyberpunk twenty seventy seven for some fucking reason. Final Fantasy fourteen, Fortnite, or Genshin Impact. Uh, Are you so gonna vote for Vercello? So I don't know See, why. It's also gonna win, which is well, the most confusing part. Knowing my rationale for the last category, y'all know my vote. No. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Final, Final Fantasy fourteen. <laughs> yeah. Genshin. Yeah. Genshin. Okay. Can we vote Final Honestly, Fantasy fourteen? That's gonna have a win. Solid argument for that. Fortnite? I think Fortnite never fell was off. on. What do you mean? I yeah, think I mean, Apex you also fell off. Took off to the characters in Fortnite. And Apex. Ah, oh, that's yeah. Right, that's that, what I'm that. saying. Like all these, like like all these ca- <laughs> games have very jerk offable characters. <laughs> is this the any votes Fortnite? Award? This is the Coomer category. Uh, this is actually not the Coomer uh, category. Is, wait, this ca- it's best Coomer game, right? <laughs> okay, can we vote Final Fantasy XIV? <laughs> Yeah, it, I mean, Final Fantasy fourteen always wins this category. I feel like it probably will. I could absolutely see Cyberpunk. I could, I could see Cyberpunk absolutely winning. see Cyberpunk winning, and if it does, I will. I will vomit on the floor. No, no I, I don't, don't want, want it either. To. I could it's see stupid. it winning, but I don't want it to. Not, the game is fixed. Shut up, man. It's not, it's not an ongoing, ongoing game. game. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest. That's the point. Yeah. It's you know a game, like, game that got updated, <laughs> and it has a bad Cyberpunk was. I forgot that it came out like like three years ago. Yeah, I know. Like I thought, I thought it came out. They like, pretty last much released year, it this year, and then year. this There's was like literally... the one year anniversary. I'm like, no, this game came out a long ass time ago, and I just forgot it existed. I feel that this is so dead. All right, we're definitely like at least halfway now. Right, you said that like ten categories ago. <laughs> <laughs> I think you actually did. All right, best esports code. Wait, wait, wait! Funny story. E-code. Funny story. E-code. I already know. There's Funny a- story about this. Um, okay, just load up the category so I can get his name right. <laughs> Me and okay, my E. So, so fun story with XTQZZZ is he joined after the team he joined. Vitality won the last CSGO major. And he himself on Twitter said, okay, let's be serious for two minutes. Put me off of this. Like, unnominate me. That's so funny. So what, he hasn't actually, like... Okay done any coaching or, or like he's coached he's been a coach for this team for like three weeks <laughs> that's so funny what the he fuck is. what about what about the coach that was before him why didn't they nominate him? sonic he is he's on here oh he is what the sonic that's fuck? so funny actually <laughs> you gotta give it so to strange. him man. <laughs> it's gonna be porter it's nah, gonna be porter, porter because not Porter's only is she the only, the only female ones. on here but she won like you mean potter what is potter Potter's are. I don't care. She was a mid Potter's CSGO right. player. Mid. Damn. But Potter, uh, Potter took the like worst team in VCT. Wasn't she and also went. like before coaching a really like on a mid um, TSM team? Or, not TSM. Martin hates TSM. women. I'm not, I'm not Everest. I'm not Everest. I don't hate women. I love and respect them. We gotta keep up the narrative, okay? No, I'm sick of the narrative. Best narrative ever hates women. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, oh, e game. Right. Yes, yeah, e best e game. E come. <laughs> <E-cum. laughs> Ten seconds. What's <laughs> <laughs> the Miyamoto meme where it's like they say the uh, game is to come? Why is PUBG? Oh, PUBG Mobile. <laughs> yes, I believe that's PUBG best. Mobile. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so all right. <laughs> the, the point of the game is to not come, but I end up coming. That's bad Yamoto game design. <laughs> Yamoto said that, so it has to be true. But also, CS2 does not deserve yes, to be okay. out here. Best esports Pop game, G's the so nominees weird. are Counter Strike. Papa G Mobile. <laughs> I mean, when we were at PAX, uh, there was a. Pr- pretty sure there was PUBG Mobile in there. Is he that a COD Mobile? Baba G? I don't know. Oh, yeah, it was. Shit. That was COD. Yeah, but the, the nominees are Counter Strike 2. Dota 2, yeah. League of Legends, you. PUBG Mobile, <laughs> and yeah. Valorant. Oh, God. Valorant's going to win this. I think Valorant's going to win this. Because they, they, ha- they actually made good things to, like, become... like the, They made the road well, to the, pro the actually good. CS2 literally the came out like two weeks ago. 
I mean, when you really think about it, Valorant's kind of yeah. like the Beatles of video games. D- d- okay, so you have to not That's like them. That's true. Like I don't think I, anybody has ever said that. No, no you know what? Is, uh, no, you know what? Um, League of Legends Valorant is, the, is imagined, the... League of Legends is the Imagine Dragons of the game industry. Valorant is the... <laughs> League of Legends <laughs> is the dog is the shit of the of video game games. Company. What? No. No, the Weezer, the Weezer yeah, video shit? games would be like like Coffin of Andy and Lele. Um, of no, esports, sorry, of esports, of esports. Of esports? No, not even that. Weezer kept me saying Weezer that League of Legends is dog shit before, like I get, uh, before I get killed. <laughs> Yo, we, we all agree on Valorant. <laughs> yes. Why did you guys put PUBG Mobile? Poster looks cool. It is a cool poster. I mean, the art it team is. at Riot always pops the fuck oh. off. Yeah, Marshall always said that because he 100% jerks it to the Rule 34. Um, I love Riot Games. Score and music. All right, this is the category. I thought we matters. picked that already. Uh, if there's one game nope. not nominated here that should be nominated, I'm going to vomit on the floor. Yes, Mario guys. Donald, I can, we know High Fire <laughs> Rush. Yes, yes, for yes, Six Days in Fallujah. Okay. Okay. High Fire so Rush is true, nominated. Mario, what the fuck? All is right with the world. <laughs> um, um, so the nominees are I Alan Wake 2, composer... Played. Petri Alonko, hey. Baldur's Gate 3, composer Borislav Slavov, that sounds like a fake Bory. name, uh, <laughs> okay. Final Fantasy 16, composer, Ever just, Ever just hates, like, like, you, you, you hates Europeans. No, so like it's that. not that, it's just like, I don't, it's not that, like that, <laughs> it's like, quick, th- you gotta, you're, you're a secret agent, you gotta think of a fake, you gotta think of a fake uh, European blah, blah. name, uh, uh, Borislav Slav, Slavov. No, I would not, no. What? No, it's ba- it's yeah. Bob Blah Blah yeah, Attorney uh, at So uh, nominees are yeah, Alan Wake, Baldur's Gate, Final Fantasy 16, composer Masayoshi Soken, oh, Hi-Fi Shogun, Rush, boy. audio director Shuichi Kobori, or Legend of Zelda: Tears of the Kingdom, composed by the Nintendo Sound Team. Okay, no names for off. them. Yeah, they're part of the fucking <laughs> Nintendo pipeline. They're, number- they're numbers in the Nintendo system. It's Legend of Zelda: Tears of the Kingdom, composed by Nintendo employee number 632. I gotta give it to my boy Soken. He beat cancer, so and he's gonna beat all these fools. Yeah, he did beat cancer. So, oh, he beat cancer. That's that's actually pretty huge. Yeah, but like, but does Final Fantasy sixteen have the black keys in it? What's what's that's what, what game has thought. the black keys? Sure. High Five Rush. Rush. It's like one of the first licensed tracks you hear in the game. Yeah, that's true. That's true. I mean, I want High Fi Rush to win, obviously, but it, uh, I'm torn it between Soken and. Uh, uh, K- uh, Kobo Kabori. Jesus Christ, I can't read. They're gonna. I can't they're, read. Whoa. <laughs> no, the 16 soundtrack goes crazy. Load up. 16 soundtrack is really good. That's a thing. Okay. okay. <laughs> yeah, we can. Well, we'll give it to 16. We'll Does Alan Wake even have a soundtrack? <laughs> no, the game is wrestling. The entire game is silent. It's actually, yeah, Silent Hill. Yeah, you never know. That's end, that's like, a, that was the biggest the whole time. decision they made actually in development. <laughs> I was Alan Woke. We did sound, and we got did score. Now it's I audio didn't play design. Alan Wake. I sat my white ass down and listened. <laughs> Literally. Ooh, okay, low key, <laughs> low key. Uh, I can argue Why for Dead Space. Space here, but I can uh, argue. Now for you Dead do Space. high fire. Dead Space so, is really good fully audio. No, not the that. I mean, like I thought we get design. more uh, more dominations for Dead Space in the. Uh, yeah. Oh, you thought there would be more. Dead okay. Space Audio and Chris streams it from his fucking <laughs> <laughs> See, the problem, Steven, Steven, Chris Steven, yeah. the problem, Steven, is that Dead Space is like a 15-year-old game. Yeah, what? yeah, it's, it's like it's like wait, the Beatles. Wait. Yes, there are no other 15-year-old <laughs> games in this category at all. Wait, so you're no. telling me... You're telling there's me that there's Resident none Evil 4 and here. Dead Space deserve to be on the ongoing no, category? No, 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 no. Steven was just like, oh, I'm surprised that like Dead Space didn't get more nominations. And I'm like, uh, I, like, I understand why it got nominated here. But I'm just saying that I, I understand why it didn't get more nominations. And it's it's because it's, it's, it's a remake of an old game. What do you mean? It should be on ongoing. It should be an ongoing Yeah, that's game. never been done before. Hmm, even, yeah. Not even <laughs> in this category. The nominees are Alan Wake 2, Dead Space remake hi-fi rush marvel spider-man 2 and resident evil 4 uh i'm s- hi-fi rush needs to win this do hi-fi rush it could no I, again i can argue for dead space 
You could argue for Dead Space. Like, come Foley, on. The Foley in that game is, like, the, the, the general audio Foley is so freaking good in that game. It is, but also, like, literally everything is synced to the audio in Hi-Fi Rush. Yeah, and? And, like, the amount of work and time that needs to be put into to get that all working, like, come on, it's got to win. It's so no, it unique. Isn't. Guitar Hero did that 15 years ago. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Another 15 year old game that's not on. Literally, I'm seeing. Oh my god, snub. Guitar Hero Snub. Guitar Hero Snub. Like, if, if the Beatles were in Hi Fi Rush, everyone would vote for Hi Fi Rush. <laughs> so true. <laughs> so true. Alright, so oh, then what, what are your guys' votes then? Huh? I mean, I would say Dead Space. Like, I love Hi Fi Rush, but I think if, if this is like a legitimate, like, someone that deserves to win, like, it's either Dead Space or, or Alan Hi-Fi Wake. Rush. Well, I don't know actually much or about Alan Wake. Wake. Alan Wake but... also has, from what I've seen, it has really good foliage too. <laughs> you can hear the, I can hear the textures. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I thought we I thought you guys said that Alan Wake Two was was a silent game. That's what you said. I said it had no. I said yeah, it had that's no a part music. of the audio design. You said, <laughs> no, it's a yeah, part it's of the audio design that's completely silent. Yeah, quite the brave choice. Okay, I, I vote Hi-Fi Rush. Rush. I think me and Mark do it though. Yeah. I don't think do that's it. Do it, do it. I'm not arguing. I'm not arguing. Thank you, Chris, for being the other voice of reason here. Shut up. He is not a voice of reason. You're a You're liar. Welcome. You guys just hate me. It's fine. I know. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, yes. I think a cri- like if if you're a critic, you're like, okay, cool, like audio oh design for God. Dead Space, but literally the the, the Hi Fi Rush is the music you- game. Is the Best music video sports game. team. Um, I, 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 okay, I, I, if there's a funny story, I'll bring it up. We got the evil geniuses from Valorant. Uh, French got, people, don't vote for them. We got Fnatic from Valorant. <laughs> That's so true. We got, I'm not Come coming back. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Get the... I cut we got the immediately. <laughs> Gaiman Gladiators from Dota 2. Gaiman Gladiators? <laughs> oh, wait. <laughs> Do not cut that out. <laughs> <laughs> oh <my laughs> I was gonna say something. <laughs> <laughs> Did you say that's all I was gonna say? I was say gay men gladiators. Yeah, and then Team yeah. Virginity. <laughs> I'm Dota Two. JD <laughs> Gaming from League of Legends <laughs> and Team Virginity from Counter Strike. <laughs> I mean, Team Virginity. Oh. Vitality. The JD uh, Vitality is uh, again. They're French, so I don't know. It's very questionable. Oh my god! Damn, Morgan hates French. <laughs> Wait, you don't? Holy shit! Yes, you don't. <laughs> I mean, cut this entire I wouldn't announce segment. it publicly. <laughs> yeah, to who? Jason? JDG isn't oh, even they in not, finals. They did not That's make finals for worlds. Did they win any other no. tournaments though? <laughs> or I guess, I guess the fucking league is different. Hey, you guys, Maybe MSI, I don't remember. You guys are the esports MS. So I don't which think that matters. Uh, I think just, just Evil Geniuses. Evil, uh, evil Geniuses, yeah. Connor is and on Evil Geniuses. Uh, so they probably have that narrative that going for them as well. That right. open narrative. I mean, like, Vitality also might be sec- like a close second because they, they won the last CSGO major. Team like, Virginity? Nah. No, that was last year. This is now. No, last CSGO major. That happened in, like, summer. Team Hyman? Uh, Hyman Gladiators. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, is that hey guys, us? Is that our back to Hyman Gladiators. <laughs> Someone rename the group. The Hyman Gladiators. <laughs> Action Adventure Games. <laughs> oh. Spider-Man and Zelda. I think it's interesting that they have two cat. They have one category for action game and the other for action Legit adventure. Jedi Survivor. Game. Because action game, action game is like character action now. Let's be honest. What? Here. I guess, but like. Well, yeah, we're gonna get like like DMC usually fits action more than it does action adventure. Okay, but it's hmm. the nominees. The nominees I think are Alan Wake Two. Are not gonna win the nominees are Alan Wake Two, Marvel's Spider-Man Two. Resident Evil 4, Star Wars Jedi Survivor, and The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. Who put Jedi Survivor here? Uh, you don't here? know, Jedi Survivor looks um, fire. This one's hard. It does. No. What? I don't think it's... I don't... I thought it was going to be Zelda. I think it's Spider-Man I think it's or Zelda. Zelda. I have to say, this, this is like the one award I, that like, Zelda can win. I could see Tears winning this. Yeah, it's a... For it's action a, what, 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 it's, it's, it's not, not going to be in the action what? category. No, but it's adventure. Adventure. I could. You also have to. 
What what is it? Okay, okay. No, scroll up. What is it? What is the category? Like description. It says combining combat with traversal puzzle solving. And it's and like it's it when you, yeah, but when is you the take combat... puzzle and traversal into account, yes, like, you can make giant ass machines that like do crazy shit and blow people up. Yeah. Okay. That's what, no, like I, I... <laughs> <laughs> No, like like genuinely I can still be <laughs> I'm down right now. Sick in that game. I, I could like see you. any of these winning the category. I don't think I don't think I don't think this one. You're right. I think, I think it's between Star Wars Mar- does that on there. Uh, you also think Alan Wake is not going to win this one? I think it's Spider Man. I think yeah. it's Spider Man, Resi, or Tears. I think it's Tears. And I, I have a Spider Man. Resi ah, Resi Four. I don't know. This is hard. Again, I'm I'm thinking of public voters. Like, of, this is like, hard. Who's here? Like, well, not pl- like Yo, the, like, like the judges. I'm just saying, like, like the, the people vote actually voting on this. <laughs> That's like the rest. That, that, okay. Uh, my uh, my votes for tears. I think tears will win. That's fair. So I, I'm vote. What's I, I, I'm throwing I think tears a toss up. I don't know. So you, I, I, think, I think it's any three, three to Chris. So because mm. me me and Steven also said tears. Fine, but tears. I'm fine with tears. All right, tears. It is. Yeah, we're we're in the home stretch, guys. Oh wow, we have like some garbage categories coming up. We're almost there. Hmm? Best mobile game. mobile game. Oh no. Hey, mobile uh, game. PUBG are, Mobile is so cool. <laughs> I think oh. mobile games are getting and are going to get better. Best and better. mobile game. I, I saw uh, the Final Battle Fantasy Royale. VII. There. Okay, is this Honkai? Sorry. Isn't it also like getting delisted? I'm pretty sure the servers are already going down for every yeah. crisis. Oh, uh, okay. Well, they're not. Oh, they're wait, not... no, they have the battle royale. This oh, is not the battle is royale, Steven. This one. No, this is the this is the Final Fantasy VII. I don't know. It's just like a pseudo remake on the phones. The nominees are Final Fantasy VII Ever Crisis, okay. Hello Kitty Island Adventure, Honkai Star Rail. Monster Hunter now, <laughs> and Terra Nil. Uh, I think it's going Honkai. I even it's know going Honkai. Ter- um, Honkai. <laughs> we literally talked about it earlier. It's a, st- it's a strategy. Oh yeah, this is what Steven was. It's a strategy game. Um, yeah, Honkai it's will Honkai. probably win. Honkai will probably win. They, they and win. and like in like three months from now, Marcello will know all the characters. Hey, you guys know my argument reasons. for this one. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, Koyoverse is Marcello? like the Beatles of game developers. <laughs> Shut up! No, 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 no. Yeah, that's true. The, um, no, just... Hoyoverse is the is the. Freaking... No, no. What's her name? Actually, unironically, Hoyoverse is the Imagine Dragons of game developers. And and stay with me here because both just keep producing slop, and the masses eat it up. You you could say that with like eighty percent of the game. <laughs> Ever is ever <laughs> saying this as he's yeah, never played. I've never, pl- I've never played the Imagine any of the games that they played. You're literally the Warriors of <laughs> That was not even your argument. I'm sorry. I know I'm insufferable. It's fine. <laughs> it's fine. And up next, we got accessibility. Oh well, this should be. Uh, we should be able to all chime in here with us all being mentally disabled. Yeah, before. <laughs> I never know what to put for these. Oh, uh, this category. This has that. six nominations. Mm-hmm. So the nominations uh, are Diablo, Diablo 4, 4, Forza Street Motorsport, Fighter. Hi-Fi Rush, Marvel's Spider-Man 2, Mortal Kombat 1, and Street Fighter 6. Okay, straight up. Well, th- like, I, I have an argument for Street Diablo Fighter 4. here. Like, the fact that a blind person yeah. made it, like, like, actually competed in EVO. With its accessibility options, that's true. Is so much of an argument. That's, that's true. Especially. That's true. Okay. Yeah, they have a whole they have a whole system. True. So that's why no, they play the game. <laughs> their accessibility options are so good. Okay. Well, what was your? I want to hear your argument. Yeah, for yeah, Diablo I, I I just I've just heard fucking people just talk about Diablo Four. Uh, like like colorblind mode and stuff like that. Just a, it just has a bunch of okay, accessibility. Of course, the colorblind again, guy would Twitter. like that. Wait. I haven't actually seen this game. No, I'm kidding. Okay. I just heard there was. I a will good say shout out. I'm glad they nominated it. Hi-Fi Rush 
Because Hi Fi Rush has a lot of cool accessibility settings for, for I genuinely like do deaf. not remember this. Oh, is it just deaf? Like, it, well, like... yeah, it's just it's basically like for people who are like can't, yeah, are hard of hearing or like are are like tone deaf, like people that can't feel the rhythm. If you know what I'm saying. Um, but but my vote's for Street Fighter Six. Yeah, Morgan. I feel so attacked for no reason. Yeah, Morgan. <laughs> are we all we go? <laughs> <laughs> I ain't done right. Sure, I didn't know that. So, uh, I'm so what, what, story. Games, what games do you think got snubbed from this category? How would I know? <laughs> I, uh, I Honkai, know. Star, Honkai Star Rail. How, how did I know you were going to make that joke? Destiny 2. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, you yeah, so you Cut mean that, you that immediately. That. Cut, that. Cut, that. Cut that immediately. Cut that. <laughs> Cut that. Cut that. Cut that now. I'm what stopping you, my recording. What did he say? No, no, no. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. He's joking. He's joking. <laughs> you need to cut that, Morgan. <laughs> we'll see. Maybe maybe I'll just do a giant sound noise. Don't say worry about it. Well. Okay. Marcella said the, the R word. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah! Oh my god, you guys. Can we get in the category? Everybody go quiet. Everybody go quiet. Mental reason. Alright, the next category is best performance. (laughs) And the nominees are Ben Starr. Uh, This one's actually very low. 16. Who'd he play? I'm assuming he's Clive Owen. He must have played the main character. I like none of these. Yeah, he's Clive. So, okay. uh, Clive I would like to be listed. Clive. 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 <laughs> Anyways, uh, Cameron Monaghan, or Monaghan, I don't know how you pronounce that. Star Wars Jedi Survivor. Oh, no, he was Cam. on Funhouse, so that, that gives him a lot of points. He was on Funhouse? What? Yeah. I can't believe Idris Elba played <laughs> Idris Elba, Elba in Cyberpunk, in Cyberpunk 2077. 2077 Phantom Liberty. Uh, Melanie Libbard in Alan Wake 2. <laughs> Melanie Libbard? Sorry, why does Neil look like that? I'm just looking at the Neil. I'm looking at oh, the Neil, 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 Neil oh. picture. Yeah, look at the Neil picture. He looks like he like, that supposed finished to be? crying or something. Gale? He's hysteric. Yeah. He's insane. That's Asterian. He is. He's really good. Oh. And, yeah. and Yuri Lowenthal. I can see Asterian in for sure. Uh, my personal voice for Yuri Lowenthal, but like I don't know. Yeah, Sasuke. I mean, else He's I literally the Beatles of voice actors, bro. <laughs> That's actually so true. Literally, I'm ironically, Yuri literally. Lowenthal is like, like the, the Imagine star Dragon. voice actor. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I'm gonna say it right now. I'm gonna <laughs> say it right so now. Hoyoverse is the is the Yoko Ono of the video game industry. Oh, okay, get it right. I can I can agree with that. I can agree with that. Okay, uh, I, mean, uh, I think yeah, I know none of the, like none of the other performances. To be honest, um, yeah, yeah Steven just doesn't <laughs> not want any of this anymore. <laughs> I I'm I'm trying so hard. Not, it's Melanie <laughs> Liberty. No, she's an yeah, Alan Wolf too. Oh, <laughs> <Shut up. laughs> people, I was what trying so it? hard. I was trying so hard not to say the joke. It was so hard. I was really trying to restrain myself. Melanie Liberty and Alan Wolf too. Get all of that. Get all of that. I'm joking. I'm gonna take it out of context and make sure we all. I hate women like that. Cut that. I don't hate women. (laughs) (laughs) All right. We got a lot for Melanie. She's the only woman in this category. True. But I'm. I'm down to vote Neil. Breathe. Oh my god, I cannot breathe. Asterian oh. is so good. Asterian's so good at Act One, dude. Yeah, <laughs> oh, I was trying is. so hard. Oh, Jesus, what do you mean? he's one of my he's one of my main squeezes. Asterian, yeah, and then you never use him again. <laughs> <laughs> I've played like thirty hours of the game. You're not even done Act One. <laughs> what does that mean? Like, hello? What? No, I'm yeah, not. but you're like arguing what? against Marcello. I'm agreeing with Except him. Goes so hard in that <laughs> Why, is this, why is this the well, category that derails us? I was just gonna say <laughs> that I I want Neil to win, but I could absolutely see Idris Elba winning because he's Idris Elba. It's Idris Elba. Idris? <laughs> but Idris Elba, I've heard is like the best well, part of the deal. Well, yeah, that's true. He does have a good performance. Marcello, or no, Marcello, Everest be like Idris Elba. Deal with. So true. Sorry, I said it wrong. You, I say shit wrong. Deal with it. We're gonna fucking not speak to each other. After this, this is the last episode of the Soy Boys podcast. <laughs>
Could you imagine? Oh, cool. Oh, thank God we're not ending on this. Oh, All right. God. Best esports athletes. Uh... <laughs> me, me. We're still Faker. I read it all these oh, fuckers. Faker. Best esports athlete. This okay, fight so Faker. Good point, Faker. Lee Faker Sang Hyok from League of Legends. Why do you say it like that? Uh, I can't, nah, you know what? This is my favorite category because it ever says Matthew, it yeah, Matthew Zaiwu Herbout from CS:GO. Herbout. <laughs> uh, Max Demon One Mazanov from Valorant. 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 <laughs> Paco Hydra Rusi 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 Call of Duty <laughs> Wait he's a Call of Duty kid? Call of Duty Park Ruler Jai Huke <laughs> from League of Legends Um I, I would say Philip, it And Philip Philip Imperial <laughs> Hal Dosen from Apex Legends Oh uh, just just put yeah, Faker Just say. Faker oh, and oh, Chris Faker I like Zyru but vote Faker Where's Faker? <laughs> And the last nomination is hey, Marcello hey. from Fallout New Vegas. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah he's from Nipton. He's from uh... 8076. <laughs> <laughs> no, who's the... Uh... <laughs> <laughs> what's, that, what's that glitch Walking into again? Nipton, like, the game. Who, who's the... Um, what's it called? What, what the fuck was it? Who's the girl on TSM Metro? Like, no, well, nobody wants to play with this guy. But then they said it on stream. and then the... Oh, that was uh, Dardock? No. no, yeah, that was, that was, uh, she was, yes, no, he, she was talking yeah. about Dardock, and that was, uh, I, what's your face? I genuinely don't remember. Uh, a double Lena. F's girlfriend, Lena. Double F's girl, Lena, Lena from TSM, but that's, a, she's in. Yeah. Uh, who's that, who's that, what's that glitch, that guy, the old guy in Fallout that oh. just gets multiplied by, yeah, easy P, the easy P, cr- uh, fucking, what is it, Migration. the crossing? No, my like crossing. <laughs> easy P, <laughs> bastard, <laughs> bastard. Um, Alright, well, Faker, go so, next. Okay, but what really, when you think about it, Faker, is like the Paul McCartney of esports players. <laughs> you don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> you <laughs> really? don't know what we gotta make about. this metaphor, like, fall apart more and more. <laughs> um, what do you mean? It was never struck. Okay, to okay, okay. With. Here's the thing, though. Hasn't Faker won this category before? Yeah, and your argument? Well, I just feel like yeah. they might give it to someone else because of that. But well, that's like, like saying Michael jo- Michael Jordan's won a fucking war to go. We shouldn't we shouldn't. Yeah, him Michael again. Jordan won MVP. So he, actually, to be fair, he has actually been snubbed with MVP because of that reasoning. That's like oh. whatever oh. Oh. last time, but he's not gonna win. This Except game. this is a Faker. Just give it Faker. This is Faker's sixth win. World Final. Uh, you're right. I'm pretty sure this is one of the categories that's entirely popular vote. This no, is I'm literally just... Faker's sixth World Final. Whatever. All I know is he's like the goat. Complain about it on Twitter. The goat. All right, and we're almost done. And I realized I forgot to put one category. Let's into do it now. The wheel. So no, we'll we'll just do these ones together after we do best action game. Nominees are Armored Core. Holy shit, that came out. Oh, this is actually this yes. is actually a good category. Holy shit. Ooh. Okay, so the the nominees are Armored Core Six, Fires of Rubicon, Dead Island Two. Why? Ghost Runner 2. <laughs> I forgot Dead Island 2 came out. Ghost Runner 2 came out? Ghost yeah. Runner 2. <laughs> I thought that was 2024. Hi-Fi Rush and Remnant 2. Hey, I just want to say... Remnant 2? Like I never played it. I just want to say it's TV. very base that Bayonetta 3 isn't here. True. <laughs> oh my god, yeah, Bayonetta 3 get... Yeah, it's also, I want to give it to... Yes, go ahead. Here's a question. Yes. What 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 considers these action games and not action adventure games? Okay, right. uh, Armor Court, uh, Dark Souls. I think it's co- primarily focused on combat. Yeah, yeah. You're not exploring. You're so not the, exploring. The, the combat okay. is. The I th- game. I think people yeah. also call it action adventure just because there's typically going to be combat in these kind in an action advent- in a, in an adventure yeah. game, right? It's an adventure but game these that, ones yeah, are mainly based around combat. Like that's the yeah, main I'll... thing. That's the that's the focus. I'll take it. Yeah. I'll take it. Oh, I literally, yeah, Anyways, focus primarily on combat up top. Yeah. Anyways, yeah. It, it's going to be Armored Core 6 because FromSoft really? is like the Beatles of the game industry. <laughs> I, I don't know. I think so it could be Ghost Shut Runner up. 2 or Remnant 2. Dead Island 2. I think I, I'm personally voting Armored Core 6. Dead Island I, 2. I don't know. Remnant 2. Wait. I want Hi Fi Rush to win, but I think Armored Core is going to win. I, I don't think, think Armored Core is going to win. Is, I, think it's, I think it's between. I, I think Hi-Fi, Ghost Runner 2 is pretty popular. I think it's Hi Fi is going to win. I think it's Remnant the... 2 or Ghost Runner 2. What? Like, Alright, so what, what, where are our votes going? I'm voting Armored Core. I can see Hi-Fi Rush. I can see Hi-Fi Rush. It's, I, I, think I, I can, can see, see Hi-Fi Rush, Rush right now. Is the combat that good in Hi-Fi Rush? Hi, in Hi-Fi Rush? Right. I don't know. Yes! Sorry? <laughs> yes. It's a real, Is the combat really good in Hi-Fi Rush? Yes! I don't know. 
It's really is solid. Is the combat really and, good and at Hi-Fi game. Rush? It's like, it's a beat-em-up. Is the combat really good it's, at Hi-Fi Rush? It's a character rush? action game? It's a character <laughs> action game, but you have to match up your, 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 like, your actions to the beat of the music. Is, the, is yeah. Hi-Fi Rush even have good combat? <laughs> can we pick one so we can get pick over this Pick Hi-Fi joke? Rush. Well, I want Morgan... <laughs> I want Steven what? and Chris. What do you want? I want Steven and Chris to fight. See if they have good combat. No, me and Steven. Me and Steven are gonna fucking kiss. Wait, what Never happened? Rush. I'm gonna. You're fucking on another planet, bro. Pick High Fi Rush. What? Well, are we voting High Fi Rush? What's so good about High Fi Rush? <laughs> Holy shit! I'm down. Can we go next? Uh, Just vote High Fi Rush or get I'm this saying... over. I want Armor Core to win, but like, I want Steven to shut up. Even All right, more. we're in the home stretch. <laughs> we're in the home stress. Best right. indie Wait, you game. gotta do it on the wheel. No, you no. clicked the best end defending game. Oh actually. my god. Best indie game. The nominees are. No, oh. you, wait, Ev. You, oh, pick, oh, you oh, literally oh. picked best uh, end defending game. I will murder you. There's two, there's two. You literally, there's two categories next to each other end defending game and indie game, and you picked end defending game. You're saying indie game. You're trolling, right? <laughs> you, you have to be trolling. <laughs> fucking thing? One's indie debut. Trolling? One's indie yes. debut, you moron. <laughs> one is best oh. indie game, and the other is best <laughs> debut indie game. So stupid. Okay, I'm gonna say it right now, by the way. Before you, okay, read out the nominees. All right, go, go. go. <laughs> okay. Go. The nominees are Cocoon, which was a fucking banger. Dave the Diver, which was also a banger. I haven't played it, but I heard it's a banger. Dredge, which looks cool. Shut up, bitch. Sea of Stars, which I don't know anything about. And Viewfinder. Can't wait to cut out all Steve's audio. I, I mean, Viewfinder, Annapurna which, uh, Gaming. Guys, I'm, I'm going to just say it right now. Apparently, according to Twitter, so this could be 50% wrong. Dave the Diver, like the Mint, ro- uh, Mint Rocket, is this. like a spinoff of Nexon. Yeah. So it's not actually indie. That's yeah. funny. Hey. Who's next on? One point eight billion dollar conglomerate subsidiary. Well, it's the same um. thing. Why isn't isn't Bungie considered an indie company? Or no, not anymore. But they used to before they got bought yeah. out by Sony. Yeah. No, that's like that's like if like a so like if like a Sony like sub studio got into this. Bungie yeah, act like they fucking act like an indie studio. <laughs> Sure. Okay. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm down to vote Annapurna. Yeah. Because I haven't played any of these games and I like uh, Sea of Stars looks really cool, but. Dave the Diver. I genuinely. I think it's Dave the Diver Cocoon. I, Dave the Diver's been getting really good reviews. All my co Dave the Diver should not win this award, but it will. What do you yeah. mean? Because Twitter. Like, but, like, it's not it's like. Twitter. Morgan's just mad because Mint Rocket is like the Beatles of the gaming industry. Literally. Ah, I'll give you for that. This isn't funny anymore. I love this joke. <laughs> this joke is so bad. Workus, like, you murdered this joke. That's like when John Lennon got murdered by uh, Jared Leto in that one movie. <laughs> Literally, <laughs> hey, in, this instance, in this instance, Morgan is John Lennon. I'm, I'm, I'm Jared Leto. I'm gonna kill myself. <laughs> Dude, Chris Dave the Diver. Yoko ono. <laughs> Dave the Diver. I did love Cocoon, though. Yeah, Cocoon's, Cocoon's really a banger. Really I just think, oh my God. I think Dave the Diver is just really unique. It is. All right, now we actually go to best indie game. Race from Achievement no. Hunter played it. Best debut indie game. The nominees are Cocoon, which is Wait, kind Pizza of Tower cheating, is there. in my opinion. But, I want but... Pizza Tower to win just so all the annoying 14-year-olds. Um, so yeah, <laughs> we'll talk about it. The nominees are Cocoon, Dredge, Pizza Tower, Venba. Um, out of these ones, honestly, I mean, I, I, I could genuinely see Pizza Tower winning. Oh, I probably will. Pizza Tower okay, is a banger. Pizza Tower. I need to play it. I really want to play it. I cook it to pizza. <laughs> you it gotta to cut pizza. that. You can't cut that. You gotta cut that. Italian. I can Italian. He's literally, I cook it to pizza. He's literally my he's, he's, he's speaking. He's speaking his native language. That's what the fuck? so bad. Uh, anything? Uh, did anything deserve to uh, be on that? What? Like, if a brown guy? Yeah, uh, Cubot. Cubot. If a brown yeah, guy makes a brown right? guy joke, he's allowed to. Him joke he's so but if, if this fucking wop. Wants to Okay, mental reset guys. <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with you? What what I do, reset. huh? You're more unfiltered than me! You're sabotaging the podcast. Get really saved for the pod. <laughs> 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 Alright. Uh, before we move on to game of the year. <coughs> yeah. What? Is there is there any is there any games that you think are, are worth talking about that weren't nominated in any of these categories? Uh RRR got snubbed for Games for Impact. The, That's all I'm gonna say. The indie game, this right. indie game called Tears of the Kingdom. I think yeah. should be on there. Okay, who do you think is gonna be Game of the Year? 
Battlefield Bad Company 2. Okay, low key. Yeah, Battlefield 2042. Technic- it just four. came out, but uh, Risk of Rain returns. Low key, like that'll get nominated next year that's, for like. That's an ongoing oh, yeah. game. That's not how that works. That's a remake. That's not how that works, but okay. Yeah, it, it can get nominated next year probably. That's not how that should work. I wouldn't be but... surprised if it missed the cutoff. The cutoffs are usually like the beginning of November. Cutoff should be. Anyways, here we go. Game of the year. We okay, so we're giving this to Baldur's Gate, right? The nominees are Alan Wake 2, Baldur's Gate 3, Marvel Spider-Man 2, Resident Evil 4, Super Mario Bros. Wonder, and The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. Resident Evil 4 should win so that a, a fucking 20 year old game wins game of the year again. <laughs> That'd be hype. This is such a good year. Jesus. Mm. So was, there's a lot of games like that came out this year that are missing. Stuff. That's uh, hype, yeah. right? Armored Core should be on here. That's all I'm saying. I thought Rush should be on here. No, yeah, Armored Core's up there. It's a banger game. Okay, but for real though, I think Super Mario Bros. Wonder has this in the bag. So true. That's really? a good one. You're a troll. <laughs> it is a really it, good game, okay, though, but no I'm gonna way say in hell. It right now, I'm going to say it right now. Uh, Super Mario Bros. Wonder is the Greta Van Fleet of video games. What the fuck does that mean? Oh that means God. it's bad? Super Mario Bros. Wonder isn't no bad, idea. though. Really? When you think and about it? And derivatives. Morgan's? Like, Super Mario Bros. U, Wii U, or U, that's Greta Van Fleet. But this, this is like, oh my God, my this is like King Gizzard. In the, in this. this is like King Gizzard and the Wizard Lizard. You know what I mean? No, no. I don't. Like, I don't. No, 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 no. I'm just, right. we did it, guys. We made <laughs> it to the end. Word. No, when I'm just really saying it's about really good. We're Baldur's Gate three, and we're going to bed. I'm just saying the when game's you, really good. When you really think about it, Steven's kind of like the Kanye West of Soy Boys. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of crazy that Alan Wake two. <laughs> Is it <laughs> game like what did for game? Everyone look at Steven like he's the motherfucking I'm glad. No, I'm glad Alan Wake got nominated. I'm really happy you did. I, I'm glad we got two horror games nominated for game of the year. I, I, I literally pretty, said that. Huge. Resident Evil Four is not a horror I'm, game. I'm I'm, I'm, I'm I'm agreeing with what you said, I'm, Steven. But uh, I, yeah, I don't know. I just don't see any situation where Baldur's Gate doesn't win Game of the Year. Man, when you think about it, Everest is really the Baldur's stuttering Gate bitch. Three sweep. Of, uh, Isn't that crazy that was... Baldur's Gate Three is gonna sweep? It's so fucking popular, and yeah, it's gonna sweep. Yeah. I mean, it's it's, it's so huge. weird. Honestly, it just it came out at the right time. This, this is like the the D and D resurgence era. Yeah. Should I be the Should I be that one prick that's like, well, technically, this game has been early access for many years. Fucking so, pro. Yeah, early, early early access <laughs> with just Act One. <laughs> I don't care. Well, I so, see good I don't things about Hitler. That. Also, every human being has <laughs> value that they brought Holy to the shit. table, especially Hitler. So you're telling me Everest is almost <laughs> out of early with access? With Everest yeah, almost he's out of early access. Out. Where's Holy Where's God. freaking Lines of Moria on these freaking categories? <laughs> It's under the, the fit girl category. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so yeah, cutting off. Best game. Best game. Best game Marcello did it by. I was literally about to say best game Marcello downloaded from Get Fit Girl this year. Yeah, so that should be a category. Best game Marcello pirated. <laughs> That's fire. That's fire. And it's just every game that came out this year nominated. Yeah. It's literally just a link to the Fit Girl website. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I I think best Baldur's pirate Gate just... house, uh, Empress or Sister Girl. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, also Pirate Bay. Throw Pirate Bay as a the three. two genders. Comedy. <laughs> yeah, the two genders. <laughs> <laughs> Empress or Big Girl. Yeah, no, Mar- like that, that's like Marcello's subcategory of game of the year because it wasn't as good as the like games he actually bought. So true. Sorry. <laughs> so he he literally bought Sorry. Tears of the Kingdom. Fuck you, mean. I heard I heard Marcello and Sub in the same sentence, and I got really excited. Hey, both Elder's Gate three. Let's end this. Oh my god! Let's <laughs> end this, end this train wreck. <laughs> yeah, we're we're uh, we're losing steam here pretty quick. Uh, but yeah, Baldur's Gate I think has. Um, and Alan Wake was actually on Epic Games. That's true. That's true. That's very true. <laughs> hey guys. We did it. We did it. You went through every category, and now you listeners at so home guys, know exactly which category, which game now is going to win every Jason, category. Jason, now you can vote. Does Jason even actually watch the videos? 
And for anyone who actually sat through the whole thing, you know what? Sound off in the comments, and we'll we'll uh, we'll, uh, we'll, uh, we'll, uh, we'll uh, <laughs> zero comments on this video. We'll, we'll shout you it's out. It's gonna be you and Everest. It's gonna be you and Everest listening. making nonsensical yeah, comments. I want to see the Dang and Rompuck dudes. I'll uh, respond to this, right? They're gonna be like, yeah. "Damn, why is it your turn to die on here?" <laughs>